I can finally get them around to getting a new radiator and a GTO. Man, like everything was broke, so I was like, I need to start working on some stuff. So got that to do. And then as soon as I got this that done, I gotta work on my old bike here. Uh it's gonna take it hill climbing, so it's like wah, ah. so I need to figure out that there too. But anyway. GTO the radiators on these are really easy. The only thing that is a pain in the butt, which would be like these clips here and here, that's where your AC condenser clips on. I don't know. Let's see. Sorry if I can spin it around here. See that, that little, this thing, it clips onto there. Uh, there's two on top, they're easy to get to. The one, there's two on the bottom there too, which are kind of hard. You got to press them down, kind of pry out on the system. Just don't rip it because you don't want to lose your AC. Other than that, I mean, this, it has a power steering cooler, but it's not attached to the radiator. So, I mean, it's just real straightforward here. This one, I don't know where it was leaking. I, I think it was this side. I think it might have separated down here. I don't see any vis visible cracks, but I mean, you can see the plastic's all busted up. So, I got the three core aluminum one here and so we're just gonna put our rubbers in i don't i have to see if it came with any any plugs though because that's for i guess it'd be your ought it for an automatic hmm hopefully it did well i'll check the box there and then these rubber wheels just go on there and then put your rubbers down there and it slides right back in let me see if we got any plugs yeah, I, there was none in that box, but I think they they look like just half inch. Might run down and get some plugs. I mean, you don't really have to because that's just where your oil would go in in for your, if you had an automatic. So it wouldn't really leak anything. But I might just probably get to tape it up too. I don't. Know. I was running down to hardware. I got a hardware store right down the road. Grab some plugs, put in there. But uh, yeah, I totally forgot about taking. You gotta take the fans off too. They're super easy to take off you just unhook your wires there and let's just fits this is some clips that fits right in there pull them out first and we'll get her back together here you know what that sound is that's the sound of my anger just going through the roof yeah so i figured that uh they would have i didn't even look it up that I thought there'd be like a sleeve or something there. No, just right through the condenser. That bolt just tore a little hole in it and now it's leaking my AC everywhere. Oh my god, I'm so mad. I think, man, I'm gonna try some stop leak. Yeah, yeah, so there it is. Uh, fits in there really nice actually. Goes in there. Still got a good bit of room. Looks good. Things seems to work. <laughs> Put some JB Weld on there. Tried soldering it there, but I couldn't. Uh, I might take it out and try to solder it, but got some go quick steel in there and I'm gonna put some stop leak in. See if that works. So if you do, just be careful. Let's see, oh, you can't have that one out. But yeah, the bolt just goes like straight through there. And if that's not lined up perfect, there's that bolt at. <clears throat> That yeah, bolt's kind of sharp edge there, and it just just pinched it and poke a hole in it. But yeah, looks good.